What's going on guys, welcome back to UFC 3 with our legendary career. We are coming up to our next rival, Shogun Hua. Uh, that's going to be a tough fight there, we're going to see who we've got next. Ali Latifi or Jan Blawich. Who can we go with, who is more likely to give us a challenge? They're both pretty similar in ways. Um, probably Blawich will probably be the easiest one to take on. Because his grapple is slightly lower, other than that they're pretty much the same. You know, he's he's lower ranked. He's rank 11. We're rank 9. Latifi's rank 10. Uh, you know what? We will take on the Polish powerhouse. We'll give it a go. We'll risk it. You know, I mean, not, you know, Latifi is pretty much like the Swedish sledgehammer. So we might as well just risk it with either of them. But we'll take on the Polish powerhouse. All right, guys, I wanted to, as we get into almost championship level, I want to focus on a bit more of our stand-up. We're still going to be focusing on the ground game, but every fight starts on the feet, so it made sense to just just focus a little bit on some stand-up and unlock some, uh, some moves. Some more moves unlocked, the body hook and the jab, which is always good. Nice to have a level 3 jab, nice and snappy, and then a cheeky little body hook up to level 2. So we're getting there already with our stand-up. Alright guys, let's get into this fight we trained. Um, I had to do sparring twice and I tell you what, it was rough both times. I pretty much got one I got knocked out twice in sparring. So I'm a little bit worried for this fight, but we knew this going in. Uh, and if we take our first loss, then so be it. But hopefully we will remain undefeated this episode. So let's, uh, let's just focus one fight at a time. And let's try and get this one done. Alright, we're 29. And we have the same reach. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, I'm ready to go here with live action from the Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. All right, here we go with I'm sparring. I know he hits hard. Yep. Yep. Okay, not not a good start. They did say there's an onslaught at the start of each round. Not a great start. Not a great start at all. Not great. Limping here. Switching stances here. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. That punch will work right through the guard. Also, he gets clipped once again here, Joe, and he continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's keeping his head on the center line. He's got to change things up a little bit here. All right, here you go. He's slowed down now. So they, they literally, the sparring was right. He literally just an onslaught at the start of the round. Again, engaging in the clinch here, Joe. And now he's got the tie clinch. He's orthodox now. He got tagged there. These guys are swinging. And a nice one-two with the right and the left. He tagged him with that right hand. Establishing the jab here. Very good job of timing these punches. Oh, this is a main event as well. I didn't notice that. This is a main event fight because it's five rounds. Double jab there by Blahovich. Lands to the body there. We don't, we don't wanna we don't wanna throw them in boxing range. Down there. How good is his takedown defense? Ooh, blocks the shot. Big left hand lands upstairs. Good combinations. Alright, good jabs. Ooh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Tags him. Back to the clinch here, Joe. Lands a knee to the body here in the clinch. Nice knee to the body. Less than a minute to go in the round. Nice brawl. Oh, veteran stuff there. He pummels under. Now he's got the underhook. So Joe jockeying for position here in the clinch. Both fighters trying to get to a more advantageous position. I think he's probably going to try and take me down. Seconds to go in round one. All right, we're good. Really missed with that right hand. I feel like I'm oh, probably right quite hand. exhausted. Effective punch there 
All right, I think we lost that round, but we picked up the striking. Okay, it's okay. So we're going to go into this next round. We're going to survive this onslaught at the start. Move our head. And move our head. Decent right hook attempt, but it's no good. Well, this guy's striking is on a completely different level since he has aligned himself with Carissi's gym there in the United States. I've never seen Gus this excited about a mixed martial arts athlete. And even just seeing him hit pads at the open workouts, candidly, Joe, looks like a complete... Oh! This could be it right here. Oh! Shit. It's all good. It's all good. He's, he's working well. He's working well. Big body shot. Body. Nasty combinations here. Oh, very nice. Powerful jab. Oh, he snaps off the jab yet again. Beautiful use of the jab. Really start to shit. Tonight. Did it in the previous round and picking up right where he left off here. Oh. How about that shin? Blahovic's lower jaw could not look much worse, Joe. Extremely swollen at this point in time. We'll keep an eye on it. Well, that, back, that backhand hook is landing every time. Clinch now. He moves oh, the Muay Thai clinch. Oh, nice knee. Oh! He's hanging on here, but he is in big, big trouble. Body kick, look at that. Yeah, oh. looks a little wobbly on his feet. Damn it. Break, break, just break. That backhand hook is landing every time, so why would I don't fix what's not broken, I suppose? Is there, are we both hurt? No, he's hurt. with the jab. Wahovich gets in the clinch yet again. Oh, whoa! He's rocked. Oh. Let's go. That's it. He's out. That's Let's go, out. baby. Come on. What a Such good adjustments. Man. Such good adjustments. Oh, my God. That was tough. First main event fight. We come out on top. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, oh, we lost that first round and we just made good adjustments. Simple as that, really. Bang. Check out this angle here. Down for the count. Let's go, baby. Let's skip that. Another knockout. For our highlight reel, another performance bonus. We are doing splendid. Alright, we now get to choose between three. Oh, Glover at rank 13. Ilal Latifi or CB Dolloway. Well, CB Dolloway is rank number seven and he's the only fight that is medium hype i think this is the one we're gonna have to go with medium hype six weeks of training rank number seven he didn't want to make sense for us why would we want to go back and fight people that are lower rank than us especially that far back at 13 and 10. so i know we're going to stay at this boxing gym uh until we make enough money to go to the top jujitsu gym and then we're going to train there and hopefully unlock lots of submissions and stuff um but you know to start off the episode to get a nice little KO or TKO I suppose that would be because you know he, he wasn't stone cold but he was pretty out so yeah let's let's do this one all right lots of moves unlocked guys more stand up obviously because that's what we're going to be working on this episode uh, because you know last thing we want is to be phenomenal on the ground and get busted up on the feet because that is not what we want at all and look the lead overhand bang I doubt we'll be using it to be honest because that's just too much stamina use. But still, it's good to have in the arsenal. You never know. Alright, guys. Coming to the end of this training camp. We're going to look at the body jab. Which is one thing, obviously, I've been trying to use a bit more. Is, is just body jab and body straights. 
And then we also unlock something we probably won't use because it might use a bit too much stamina, but that is the Superman Punch. It's a very powerful punch as it is, so it could come in handy at some point. Maybe just if someone's rocked and I can tell their block's kind of down, I could just leap in with that, bang, and then they uh, they fall to the ground. Let's have a Are we 30 yet? No, we're 29 still. All right. We have a little bit of a reach advantage, but nothing special. I'm surprised Dollarway is still here, to be honest, it's in the top of the light heavyweight. He's making me tired. Good shot to the body. And he's back in the guard. Nice punch there by Dalloway. Trying to pass here. I don't feel comfortable on the ground just yet. We're gonna get up. Tags him. In the clutch. No. One underhook. No. Goes back to the southpaw stance here. Good I knew he was going to look for takedowns. Looks like he's in on a double leg takedown, Joe. Unable to finish it. Anaconda. I don't know if I'll get him, but hopefully this will make his like takedown attempt a little bit, him. a little bit okay, less. If we don't get him, maybe this will just scare him enough so he'll be like, oh, I don't, I don't, I don't want to. And we got him, never mind. Let's go, baby. That is what you get. Do not tangle with the Cobra. The Anaconda we got him with. Oh, nice. Let's go. Damn, we were losing them exchanges on the ground there. It just shows you can't, we can't even be overconfident on the ground, don't it? It just shows we cannot be overconfident on the ground. And we can see one more time this anaconda locked in perfectly for the victory. Oh, that's a nasty submission, that. People have been saying and they want to see more real submissions, not like twisters time, and stuff. And, no you know, anaconda, easy one to land. Not easy one to land, obviously, but, you know, one we do see. So a seminal moment for this fighter Let's here go. Tonight. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffett. You love to see it, guys. That's another submission on the resume. He was out striking us badly as well in that one. All right, guys, it's time for our rivalry fight against Shogun. He is old. He is past his prime, but he's still got a 90 stand up and 89 health. We've got we've got better stamina and better grapple than him. And it's a short notice fight. We've only got two weeks to train. So let's hope we can go in and peak fitness. That's the most important thing. 35 and 17. This should push us to total contention if we're able to win this one, guys. Two weeks to train is all we've got. Let's give it our best shot. i got to admit, you surprised me. I guess I should be nice now. The punk you are. This is a red title, and I'm glad to take it. Shut your ass up, boy. All right, we may as well, yeah. We didn't do all of the um, all the stuff we could have, all the press stuff we could have, but this is this is a legendary career, and this Shogun's got ten stats higher than us on stand up. We can't be going in with sixty percent fitness. We need to be at peak fitness in for every single fight. I'm Megan O'Levy, and this is your UFC minute. 
This weekend, we brace for a crucial matchup, which is expected to shake up an entire division. To get into position for a world title shot, this fighter has fought tooth and nail against the best the light heavyweight division has to offer. And while getting into a number one contender's match is sweet enough, if this fighter beats his heated rival to earn that shot at the belt, the victory would be even more satisfying. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. Coming up next, All right, I'm starting to get the recognition I deserve. Let's see. Tail of the tape. Tail of the tape. Let's see it. 40, 30. Usually at this point, my character's like 24. <laughs> That's why I want to make everyone of Caesar a bit older. All right. Two Brazilians going at it. Right. The only thing they warned me about was staying in the clinch with him. Jesus. Jesus Christ. It's alright though. I don't if he wants to do that them, them flurries, I'm 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 happy with it. This is not where I want to be with him. If he wants to do like Heavy flurries and tire himself out. I'm okay with that. Strong takedown defense here, Joe. Single leg attempt does not materialize. Needs a jab there. He did warn me about the body kicks as well. Blocks the punch. Oh, that was a big left hand he connected with. Oh, straight right. Changes his stance. Oh. It's not a main event either, this one. Oh, here's a kick to the body. Blocked though by who? I don't know if Shogun could really go five rounds anymore. So good. So good. Really missed with that right hand. Back to Orthodox. Big power shot there. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Oh, we caught him with that right hand. Here's the kick blocked by Hua. Nice jab. Well, the right hand has been there missed. at times, not that time. Just over two minutes to go. All right, other than him rocking us, I think so far we've been oh, pretty much in the lead. Really swung everything into that kick, but fell short. Huge block there. Oh, one, two. Okay. Try to establish that jab. He got tagged there. Good defense here, Joe, as the hook to the head is blocked. Hua goes for the takedown. He misses. Oh, leg kick is good. That's a nice clean shot. Nice. He's got the tie clinch now. Oh, he's getting some hip in that one. <clears throat> nice deception there as he lands the hook. Inside leg kick. I'm going to really make these leg kicks hurt going into the second round. Alright, you check that one. It's fine. He gets the tie again. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It hurts a little bit. I don't know. That, that round's probably his, but it could go either way. I could go either way that round. I was hurt in the clinch, which they warned me about. It's okay though. All right, round two. Fucking touching gloves with you. Damn it. Punch coming, it's blocked. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. Damn it. Is there. 
So good. Good, so good. We'll, we'll, we'll win this round. We'll stay here. We'll win this round. We'll, we'll dominate him here. Oh no, never mind. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly no. found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Looks like his Shit. leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Well, Hua's kick attempt there blocked. Whoa! Shit. This could be it right here. So good. So good. Body kick, look at that. Oh, he might be out. Yep, this could be it. No, I'm good. that jab once again landed that one 30 seconds to go in round two nice punch by Hua starting to do some really significant damage to the body here another strike lands there final seconds here of round number two wow this fight is dangerously close to being stopped all right I don't think this is going well for me. I think I'm probably down two, two zip, probably. I don't know. I mean, we had good top control for ages, but he, he took us down. He didn't drop us, but he took us down and he did rock us. So this could be 1-1, one, one, depending on how they got shit. I'm going to stop throwing that leg kick. I feel like he's tired. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the bowl, oh! you can tell that shot hurt him bad in the body. Oh! So hold oh, this is no. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Nice leg kick. Ah, oh, for God's sake, my legs are taking a beat on as well. Let's go! Vicious, vicious. Oh, fuck, it didn't let me hit him properly. Right, no, 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 no. Oh, that's not what you want. Moves to north south. Let's move back into side control once more. Under three minutes now to go in round three. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. Really start to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter. Take the judges out of it. Wow! He's in big, big trouble here. Man has his chin been tested early. It's because I know I can't win through the Whoa. judges' scorecards. Big shots. He's got to go down eventually. No, no! No! 
shit. If I look on the judges' scorecards and I was winning, I'm going to be pissed. Oh, no. Oh, he was just taking so much damage. Bang. Oh, that's so stupid. Oh, pissed. Fuck. Oh, it was fight of the night, though. Which I don't get often. And a 70% longevity. Jesus. Yeah, he was up two of the round, which is frustrating because he probably shouldn't have been. But I suppose maybe he should have been. And then that one. Oh, we rocked him so much and we were battering him. We were absolutely battering him that one, that last round. He was hurt and all sorts. Oh, I'm so pissed about that. I'm so pissed. All right, I suppose we should have to do one more fight for this video and try and end it on a win. But that is tough, guys. That is tough. Bitter defeat to Rua has put the brakes on Caesars rising up the ranks. Damn, bro, you hate to see it. I think Rampage is a bit risky. They're both quite low-hyped fights. This fight's better for my career. I want to get back on the winning ways. So this is the fight we're going to go with. We could fight a great like Rampage. But for now we're going to stick with a fight. That I feel like I can win confidently. And uh, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll get the W here. Damn that's rough. Very low fight height. People aren't that bothered about me at the minute. But it is what it is. We're going to go into this fight. Get back on our winning ways. Um... And, uh, yeah, and then, you know, we've got one more fight next video and then uh, pick up the rival again. Then hopefully a couple of fights towards the title. And it won't be too long before we win the championship of the world. I apologise if you guys can hear any banging. My neighbours are having work done again. All right. We are now. All right. Adversity could be something that buoys him going forward. Certainly, nobody wants to be knocked out and in devastating fashion the way he was in his last fight. But now, tonight, another opportunity to prove that he is one of the best in the world in this division. Oh, clip him with the jab. All right, first round is underway, and you know what to look out for here. The powerful overhand punches. That is a big part of his game plan. Every time he makes this walk, it is his go-to punch. We'll see if he can find a home for it early tonight. Watch the shot here, Joe. Working on a single leg here. Damn. Switching All right, fair enough. Here. Nice kick to the body. Nice Alright, I need to breathe, bro. I'm getting angry because I lost my last fight. I'm just going to be smart. No. Hold on. Double under. Body lock. I always get the wrong arm. There we go. He's got the double. The Bang. Is there. Two minutes to go in round one. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Right, I fucking put your ass to sleep for that, bitch. I want to get back to my win and ways, and the way I know how to do that is to make some bitch tap. If not, it weakens his head. We know this. We, we know this from experience. Got him. Got him. You're going to tap? Let's go. Let's go, baby. Back to winning ways. That's what we like to see. Oh, thing of beauty. Thank fuck. 
That was really I mean, we were banging him up on the stand-up. We were absolutely piecing him apart. He just had a good chin. And I was like, nah, I'm not going to get myself stressed and be tired coming into, like, the third, fourth round. So I'm just going to fucking... He'll, I'll get him to the ground at some point. And here it is again. And, uh, Beautiful arm triangle submission. Absolutely and that's what we done. Perfectly executed. In his clinch, we got the body lock high and we fucking took his ass down. We, we were piecing him up, though. We were piecing him up. Submission, let's go. Let's see wins. But unfortunately, no more consecutive wins in a row. It's tough to see. But you know what? We might get performance bonuses. Because we've done so well with that so far. I mean, apparently he was out striking us, but I felt like we were landing cleaner than he was. Oh, I've, no, he landed loads in half guard, didn't he? But before that, we um, we were out striking him for sure. Look at that. Boom, everyone's saying I'm back on track. Let's go. You know, most martial arts have a loss on their... Um, most martial arts have a loss on their record, so I'm not going to be too butthurt about it. But next video will be the rematch between me and Shogun. A fight I'm looking forward to. He does hold a victory over me. That's tough to see. As we see there. He literally, the last 55 seconds, I'm pissed about that. <laughs> I mean, we'd, I'd rather have lost by decision, to be honest. But we got KO'd. It is what it is. And we're going to go into the next fight. Um, good. And then we're going to take on Shogun. Let's see who's next before we go into it. Obviously, which will be next episode. Patrick Cummins. Or a rematch with Jan Blauwich. We'll go with Cummins because we've already fought Blauwich. So I don't see the point in that one. But yes, thank you guys for watching. If you've enjoyed, be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.